Hello guys, my name is Barton. Welcome to your 12th tutorial on ISO 8583. So this is going to be our last tutorial in this particular series. So in this particular tutorial, we are going to create a full ISO message and then unpack it. So we're going to pack a whole message and then unpack it. So we're going to have two messages. One is an echo message and another is a funds transfer message. So let me go ahead and open this up. So as you can see, this is just a simple test, right? So basically, just like the other test that we've done, I'm basically reading the configuration file and converting it into an in-memory ISO field. So in this particular case, since we are creating a whole field, or rather a whole message, then we are going to use the compound field interface. Okay, so create an instance of that, and then uh, well pass in the configuration file here and then set the values that you actually want okay so this is how you would actually use this library okay this is how you use it in practice after you set all the values that you want then you call encode and you get the encoded value so you can convert this to bytes and send it over the network okay so that's what i'm doing so this here is just an assertion to make sure that the code is not actually lying to us okay so if i actually run this yeah voila we can see that our test was successful so this is the value and this is the encoded value so as you can see the binary Rather, the bitmap is encoded in binary, and this is the actual value for the bitmap. So the other fields are all encoded in ASCII, as you can see. So this is the encode part, and this is the decode part. Okay. So all this configuration that determines whether a field is in ASCII or is in BCD, I've included that in a file called isofield.xml. So this file is within the project. So if you go to the test resources folder, you'll find that file here. So you can change it the way you want. Okay, guys. Uh, so the next particular test is going to include a funds transfer test. Okay. So this is similar to the other test. The only difference is that we have a couple of more fields. Okay. So just go ahead and look at these values and what they mean right most of these numeric fields have been encoded using bcd so you'll notice that if i get a numeric field like the currency code for the transaction you see the value that i set here is 835 right this is a numeric with length 3 but if i were to encode this in binary then i would have to prepend a zero here so that this becomes a full byte right so when i'm decoding or rather after decoding when i'm doing the assertion i have to prepend a zero here because the encoder actually added an extra zero but that does it doesn't cause any problems because these are just numeric values so whether you have 0 835 or 835 for all purposes for all <laughs> You know that that is exactly the same value. You know, it's still 835 because it's a number, right? So if I go ahead and run this test, let me run it. Test the file. Now we watch the magic happen. Well, it seems like our test was very successful. So I'm going to put this project on GitHub so you can download it you can fork it and you can actually see the code you can change it to your liking you know so i'm going to put this code on github so i'll actually leave all those details uh, in the description below so that you guys can actually you know have access to this so i want to to share this with you guys because uh, you know, when i was learning iso 8583 i really had a big problem with this stuff so you know it's good to make 
not to, to share this stuff with other guys okay so as you can see our test was successful so go ahead and go through this and try to understand if you have any question just leave it out in the comments and i'll be i'll, I'll make sure to get back to you so that's it for this particular series guys if you want us to write this particular library in another language actually i was thinking about writing it in go so you can just you know uh, leave your suggestions in the comments okay so that's it for this series guys and thanks very th thanks a lot for watching so bye guys